Oh my god, this was the other thing. What? Oh, what? So this ties into the uh, the Yule lands. Oh my god, what? Someone sent us the Yule Cat. What? The Yule Cat is a monster from Icelandic folklore, a huge and vicious cat said to lurk about the snowy countryside during Christmas time and eat people who have not received any new clothes to wear before Christmas Eve. What a oh dick! Oh my god! You just, just search Yule Cat. There's so many good... Look at that one. Oh my god! Yule Cat's so <laughs> sassy and fat! Oh my god, that's a big-ass poem they got. About the Yule Cat? Okay, here's the whole poem. You all know the Yule Cat, and the cat was huge indeed. People didn't know where he came from or where he went. He opened his glaring eyes wide, the two of them glowing bright. It took a really brave man to look straight into them. He gave a wave of his strong tail. He jumped and he clawed and he hissed, sometimes in the valley, sometimes by the shore. <laughs> if one heard a pitiful meow... Something evil would happen soon. Everyone knew he hunted men, but he didn't care for mice. <laughs> <laughs> he, he picked on the very poor <laughs> that no new garments got. From them, he took in one fell swoop their whole Yule dinner, always eating it himself if he possibly could. What Hence, a it dick! Was... <laughs> <laughs> that sucks. I mean, that sounds like a cat. Uh, hence, it was the women at their spinning wheel set, spinning a colorful thread for a frock or a little sock. Because you mustn't let the cat get a hold of the children. They had to go something new to wear from the grown-ups each year. When the lights came on on Yule's Eve and the cat peered in, the little children stood rosy and proud, all dressed in their new clothes. Some had gotten an apron, some had gotten shoes, or something that was needed. That's all it took. For all who got something new to wear stayed out of that pussycat's gasp. Grasp, even. He then gave an awful hiss, but went on his way. Now you might be thinking of helping, where help is needed most. Perhaps you'll find some children that have nothing at all. Perhaps searching for those that live in a lightless world will give you a happy day and a merry, merry Yule. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. So the moral is give to those who are less fortunate is what the moral is. Yeah. But the implication isn't like do it because it's the right thing to do. The implication is if you don't, a cat will eat them. <laughs> yeah. <that's, laughs> if you don't take care it. of these homeless kids, a cat's going to eat them. That's the story? That's crazy. That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Iceland is out of control.